VitaDAO is funding the future of longevity research. Recently, they were the first DAO ever to kickstart a biotech company, Matrix Biosciences, where they are trying to study naked mole rats and a secretion that they have in order to prolong lifespan and reduce cancers. I made a video on this and I got a lot of questions about people just kind of like confused about what VitaDAO actually is and how it operates. So I figured what better place to go than directly to the source about five months ago they posted this video kind of explaining what VitaDAO does and how they operate what product market fit they have right because as investors specifically me okay I'm not saying you need to invest in anything crypto related or DeSci related but I am an investor and so I like asking why does this product need to exist not just how can I make money off of it I invest in the why not the coin itself so are let's get you ready it. to join the future of longevity science for centuries scientists have been developing technologies and medicines that increase longevity that's good often this means finding novel therapies to treat or sometimes even cure disease helping people live longer that's really good but to achieve major increases in longevity you have to take on age-related diseases these can be more difficult to treat due to their connection to natural biological processes so instead of managing symptoms some researchers are working to take control of their root cause aging aging isn't just gray hair and wrinkled skin I know. There's a lot more to it. It's a natural process that your cells go through, which can result in diseases like Alzheimer's, cardiovascular disease, and type 2 diabetes. All those things, really bad. Type 2 diabetes and Alzheimer's are looking like they're related. Alzheimer's is very potentially just type 3 diabetes, meaning um, insulin resistance of the brain. Going off on a little tangent here, but my degree is in nutrition and I just came across this recently, so it's very fascinating to me that we've just been having a bunch of elderly people walk around with insulin resistance in the brain and they're just going loopy. If you have diabetes, you know that if you don't get enough blood sugar, if you don't get enough insulin in your body, you go pretty loopy so it was like mind-blowing to me all of these aging related processes are connected to your diet by the way this is like a new field of research in the last 50 100 years that is emerging so we are on the cutting forefront of all of this research right now there are tons of technologies and therapeutics being developed that may be able to slow or even stop the aging process and while many of these get funding in the late stages of the research and development process once they've proven themselves effective many others are lost early on before they even that that is the main use case for this in my humble opinion, that right there outlines exactly why we need to have some sort of decentralized autonomous organization funding scientific research because we don't get what, what I just said about Alzheimer's being type 3 diabetes. This is years, decade into researching this and trying to scrape together funds from different organizations and get grants approved to do this research because if they can successfully prove this then pharmaceutical companies will be able to sell like nasal injections of insulin to people with alzheimer's so there's a profit potential in finding this as a supporting document in finding research that supports this so big pharmaceutical companies and people who are providing most of the grants and most of the funding for research are like hey where's the turnaround can i have some money in return for my investment into your research like what are you going to offer back to me as the person who's holding the money i need to know that i'm likely to get a return on my investment and so that is like really the main issue that i see with decentralized funding like this we don't need anything to come out with fruitful returns in order because no one's looking for their money back like that it's a very different dynamic even have a chance to do so due to insufficient funding and if you're like wow that sounds very frustrating i wish there was a way i could help well check this out through VitaDAO, you can take matters Vita into your own hands VitaDAO funds early stage therapeutics that could have a big impact on longevity in exchange for the intellectual property the research creates but unlike your typical medical charity 
VitaDAO is a democratic, self-governing entity whose research projects are selected and funded directly by its members. As a decentralized autonomous organization, VitaDAO has no central authority. Instead, its members participate in discussions and vote on proposals that determine everything from what researchers should receive funding to how the data and IP that's generated should be managed. The best part is that anyone can become a member of VitaDAO. In return for contributing money, work, or other resources, you get tokens called Vita that allow you to vote on and decide the future of the organization. Your funds go to support research, and more money is made when the data and IP generated through their research are sold. Since it launched in 2021, VitaDAO's nearly 9,000 members have provided over $4 million to more than 17 research projects any of which could one day revolutionize longevity science. So join VitaDAO today, become a member, and get involved with research shaping the future of human health and longevity. Visit VitaDAO.com or click the first link in the description. Cool, okay. It's very, very simple, all right? The entire idea here is extremely simple. I'm not looking for the token. When you look for something to invest into, I'm not saying to go invest in the Vita token, I'm explicitly saying as an investor, this is how I approach the markets. I look for an apparent problem. How we fund scientific research right now is an apparent problem. I then look for a company that has found a solution that I think is viable. VitaDAO has found a solution in which I think is very viable. I then look for an investment opportunity into the solution. I'm not entering into any kind of investment looking at where's the money, how can I profit the most off of this. I am looking to invest into a solution. Making money is a byproduct of that solution working out. Okay, That's all I'm going to say there. I know I'm an investment focused channel, so I have to outline it a little bit. I'm very excited about this company and this, this project. Hopefully we can continue to see this number climb. $4 million in funding is absolutely insane. Oh, congratulations. If you like this video, please go like this video, subscribe, and join us for our morning live streams. Your time's your most viable asset. So hopefully, this was worth investing into.